and we become collectives. And this is what we are doing at this university, Dr. Ramsey. Isn't that so? That you've got your collaborative circles going on here. We are working collaboratively and collectively and having national influence. And we hope that will then become international influence. And that's how it works. And here's, you've seen already the, the artifact, but here's the front cover of the bulletin that we have produced, and that contains the work of teachers. Now, that is the first publication to come out of the project that we have been working on together, but it is not the last publication. So just watch out for uh, more publications as we go along. But you can see the intention is to make work public and to build up a body of knowledge. And it's absolutely wonderful that we are, we are putting together a body of knowledge of Catholic teachers so that Kata will be seen as up there with the best. And that's the way that it should be. And what is rather special about Kata, and one of the reasons that I particularly enjoy working here, is that it is a country that shows the achievability of links between theory, practice, and policy. One of the key difficulties, as far as I'm concerned, is that very often policy makers produce the policy documents and they think, right, that's enough. There's the policy document, now it will happen. And that is an absolute fairy tale. That is a pathology. There is no direct connection between a policy document and practice in schools. Teachers and educators need the support to transform policy into practice and then to investigate their practice and to create policy out of their practice. So that from the practice, as Ms. Amal is showing us, and all the other teachers, we can create the evidence base that will inform policy so that the policy itself is relevant and meaningful to teachers and other educational institutions. Coming to the end, I am asking, what can you achieve? Using an action research methodology, you, and I mean you collectively, us collectively, and you individually, you can use an action research methodology to move and save the earth. Because the earth is in a rather fragile situation and it needs a lot of help. And the help comes from us. And the help comes mainly from teachers. I have been saying this for 30 years, and I will continue saying it until I have to say goodbye sometime. But this is it. Now, if you go to my website, you can see a lot of resources that you can download and access and use in your own workplaces, you are welcome to use that material. It would be nice if you just said where you got it from. But there is also a booklet on my website which you can download and use and you are welcome. If you would like a business card, I can give you a business card. And if you want to write to me, please do. And that's, that's my email. Uh, that's my website address, jeanmacknip.com, and there are some books there. I've got some of those books with me today, which you are welcome to look at, and some new publications coming along. And please contact me for ideas and other ideas there, and 
That's my email address. And thank you. And I hope we meet again. Thank you. Thank you very much, Professor Jean. We really enjoyed your presentation. والآن أدعو السادة الضيوف لاستراحة شاي ثم الانتقال إلى مبنى بوليس التربية لمتابعة بقية الكاس. <تصفيق>